Birmingham City take the field at Upton Park for their encounter with the cup holders. West Ham, with the light-coloured sleeves, were to set the ball rolling. A meeting of opposites. Birmingham, known for their strength in defence. West Ham, renowned for their lightning changes of tactics and formation. With Alec Jackson, number seven, well to the fore, it's Birmingham who take the offensive. He passes back to Jeff Fowden. Then after six minutes, Dennis Thwaites and Bertie All went through West Ham's defence like a red-hot poker through butter. Bingo! First blood to Birmingham. Dennis Thwaites, Alec Jackson, the instigator of so much in this game, and Jeff Vardon combined for another goal. Then after 25 minutes, a corner kick from Jackson swung into the net. Yes, the first half was certainly Birmingham's, but it ended with a foretaste of the second, a foretaste of West Ham's recovery. Arsenal making moments for Brum's goalie. Then three minutes before the interval, a cross from Sissons was pushed home by Bird. 2-1 at half-time. Then the equaliser from a fast cross by Seeley hammered home by Jeff Hurst. never for Birmingham, now or never to pull something out of the bag. But I'm afraid it's not now. West Ham take it away. Burn centres. Hurst muffs it. But soon afterwards, Hurst gets West Ham's third. Hurst meets Birmingham's Malcolm Beard for a short duel before West Ham hammered home the last one through Sissons. The last nail in Brum's coffin.